This is Capture. What photograph makes you emotional? I really like that Mary Ellen Mark photo of the girl, the young girl smoking in uh, mm. like a kiddie pool. And there's another little girl laying there. I really like that photo because it sort of, it, it reminds me of my youth. I, I was sort of that kid. And, it remind, and I see it in my son. You grew up in Florida, right? Well, I was born in Florida. I didn't grow up. I, I lived there, I think, like three days. I grew up in Northern California yeah. and a bit in Texas. I've been all over. So, uh, but that, that sort of attitude was a lot. It reminds me of my youth. I was very much like the guy who throws the brick through the window. You know, so. <laughs> what about you, sir? No, you shouldn't call me sir because oh, okay. since I left the army, uh, <laughs> that was many years ago. And the, the question, you see, when you get older, you forget. What was the question? What photograph was it, or is emotional to you? You know that that uh, that Robert Kappa shot of the uh, soldier coming up on the beach, uh, and he's swimming, and uh, and, uh, and it's D Day in Normandy, and. Um, you, you sort of wonder, is he going to make it? It kind of grabs me, yeah. uh, especially considering a lot of Kappa stuff was destroyed. We were shooting very late at night. It was a very creepy setting. And they, they started yelling to us to pass cigarettes, and they wanted belt buckles, and we sort of had this communication. She says to Elvis, I'll bet you can't kiss me, Elvis. And he makes an attempt to kiss her, and she sticks out her tongue just a little bit, and so does he. I ride a motorcycle to work and I just kept seeing so much roadkill in the back roads of Georgia that I stopped to photograph it. And it coincided with what I was explaining in these interviews and what I was doing on the show as well. I call this my Rembrandt. That tension, if you can get it in a portrait, I believe, uh, that gives a certain dynamic. And I took one frame and that's all I took. This is a band called The Locust. I like the whole aesthetic of this band and the, you know, the anonymous way that they portray their music. And he's looking at me like, what are you doing, Al? And what is he doing? Well, he's he buttoning his fly. Yeah. The thing I liked about this photograph is the hand. And it also sort of mimics the scream a little bit of the... Okay. Yeah, every month, yeah. These are good. Oh, thank you. I'll trade you for one of those albums. <laughs> <laughs>